Boxing fans, Strada Roman Promotion presents live professional boxing, Fist of Fury 10, Saturday, November 18th at the Pioneer Event Center in Lancaster. Meet tomorrow's champions, including Paula Estrada from Palmdale, Jose Hernandez from Lancaster, both fighting for the GPO title. Also included on the card, Avery Gibson, Juan Funes, Jordan Harris, Danny Favela, and many more. For information, call 661-209. 2047 661-209-2047 Brought to you by Tecate, Vision Engineering, Sam Silkscreening, and AB Boxing Club. Tickets available from $30 at Monster Fitness, AB Boxing Club, and UAVPEG.com. Doors open at 5 p.m. Live professional boxing. See you there. How are you this morning, Julie? Where you're the man. I'm great. I'm doing great, man. I'm happy to be alive and I'm living in America, living the dream, brother. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> and and that's the key. We are blessed to to be alive. Every morning that you were able to wake up, breathe, and see and hear, man, that's a blessing right there. So we can't we can't we we can't take that for granted. No, we can't. No, we can't. So you yeah. ready for some boxing? Oh, we are ready, man. Let me tell you. Are you ready for Say that again. Very exciting. I'm very excited. I can't wait. I can't yeah. wait. Yeah. You're in attendance this evening? Yeah. Yes. I told Sam. I'm going to bring a couple of friends. So okay. I'm going to make a share of my desktop. Let me see. Right. I'm going to pull up a – I'm going to try and pull up a screen here with the – with the, with the, take a look at then the, go to it slide by slide. Tell me a little bit about everything, okay? And that'd be great. Okay, so let's share that. And here, from the beginning. Excellent, yeah, so, well, yeah, that's really cool. Okay. Yeah, so, so as, as okay. we said, um, yeah, basically, Wayne's went through last, uh, yesterday afternoon. Um, that was really exciting. You know, it's, it's always good to see the fighters make weight uh, and step on that scale, man, and then do a face-off. And then, uh, you know, that's the beginning of the thing. That sets the stage for the for tonight. So uh, that was really exciting. We got that done and out of the way. So okay. uh, this is where it happens tonight. This is where it all goes down inside that ring. So we're really excited about that. Right. I got you. So cool. there's, there's a contact information, which uh, is not that important at the moment. Mm -hmm. But... Um, we got uh, an announcer. Uh, tell me about Barry. He looks like a pretty cool dude. Yeah, so Barry is actually a great guy to work with. Uh, he's full of energy, uh, very fitted. Um, he's actually out of uh, the Santa Clarita area. So I've had the opportunity to work with Barry for, um, I don't know, a couple of years or so. Um, and in many occasions, you know, multiple events. So he's a really cool guy to work with, very energized. He's got a, an amazing voice. He's got a great voice. And that's the reason why he's the chosen announcer, obviously, uh, but he's just a really cool guy, great energy all around, you know, and um, he definitely right. does his, uh, his part to promote the events, and uh, he brings a decent crowd in, so we, we definitely like working with him. He's a really good guy to work with, uh, and that's key. You know, you want good people on your team. Um, it definitely creates synergy, and, um, right. you know, the, the, the more everyone's sharing the same vision and working hard to accomplish uh, these great events, you know, which is a great experience for the fans at the end of the day, 
Um, it creates opportunity mm -hmm. for fighters, right? And then so I think that when you can build a good promotion with really good people on it, um, it goes a long ways. And then the quality of the events definitely reflects that. So, yeah, he's, he's an amazing guy to work with. <clears throat> yeah. Now, can you see these guys on the screen, Gibson? And can you see uh, the so, screen? Or you just uh, see? Yeah, I really, I really can't see the screen. But um, if you throw some names at me, I mean, I have the fight card right in front of me. So we can definitely go down the line and then talk about some of these guys, um, especially the local guys. Okay. I mean, you know. Uh, I think at the top right. of the list we have Avery Gibson, right? Yeah. Uh huh. So Was Avery, yeah. There you go. I see the flag. Um, so Avery Gibson, an amazing guy, man. He's a he's a gentle giant, you know. He's a he's a heavyweight, obviously, uh, but uh, really mean inside the ring. A gentleman outside that ring, man. He's a really kind guy. Um, you know, always brings his wife, his his young daughter. Um, you know, whenever we come to the Wayne's and promoting the events. Uh, but when he gets in the ring, every Gibson, um, you know, he gets down to business. He's a heavy hitter. He's fighting out of Lancaster. So local talent, most definitely. One of the things we do um, is that we try to bring, obviously, in boxing, you have the red corner and the blue corner. We always try to bring one corner, all local talent, you know. Nice. It's, nice. And it's good, it's good for a lot of things because... It's good for the local community where we're basically creating yeah. opportunities for local fighters. Um, but at the same time, where, wherever home is, you want, definitely want to bring the hometown guys, you know, or gals. Um, it's good for the community because everybody wants to come mm -hmm. out and support your local, your local guy, your local fighter, right? So we definitely make an effort to always have one corner full of uh, local talent. Um, yeah. In addition- so I'm talking about local guys. Go ahead. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Talk about local guys. The issue with Hernandez um, fight tonight. Yeah. Unfortunately, there was a situation where he's that that card's not going to be able to. Uh, um, yeah, and, and and that's and that's that's you know it's yeah. a shame because it's a missed opportunity. Um, Jose is an, is another great guy. Uh, works really hard inside the ring, and um, you know he's been in a, in a good winning streak. Um, he was the main event for this evening. Uh, between him and Avery, they switch off and they usually lead uh, our main events. Uh, which is really good right. for you know for for the for the community, but um, yeah, it's unfortunate because Jose was actually had an opportunity to fight for the GPO title. So and we have two mm -hmm. titles. We had initially two titles this evening, right? So one was for Jose Hernandez, right. the other was with Paul Estrada, which we'll talk um, about in just a minute here. But it's unfortunate, exactly. and um, but like we told Jose, you know, be ready for the next one. Uh, the next opportunity is coming, hopefully in December. So he needs mm -hmm. to continue training and be ready for that. I mean, it's the best thing you can do is just stay ready, you know, and 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 take care of business whenever the opportunity presents itself. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. You, but got, Jose, you got Danny Fablo. <clears throat> Danny Danny Favela is fighting to the. Yeah, so so down down the fight car, it would have been Jose, then Avery Gibson. Those are um, you know top of the line there. Uh, Paula Estrada, which um, I'm not sure uh, she she should be uh, either co-main event or main event this evening, depending on what's happening, because Paula is actually fighting for the um, the global boxing organization, the GPO title, and Paula it's a it's a local sensation, you know. Uh, she's been around boxing since she was a kid, and also obviously being the daughter of um, one of our promoters. Um, Harvey Estrada, which has been in the business for close to 27, 27, yeah, like 27 years more or less. So Herb is a legend, <clears throat> and obviously Paula Estrada brings a lot of that um, that skill set and that history to boxing. And um, anyway, so, so she's fighting tonight at 110 pounds for the GPO title, so that's going to be a really exciting fight. If If you've never seen Paula fight, it's definitely an opportunity you want to provide to yourself. Uh, she's just such a skill fighter, moves quickly, jabs, snaps, find a home every time. So you definitely want to see Paula in action. Well, okay. Go ahead, Dooley. Anyway. Yeah. Uh, a couple of other local talents on the car, obviously, this evening. Uh, Jordan Harris is an up-and-coming. Uh, as of now, uh, Jordan Harris is it's 
it's it's one guy that I definitely love enjoying the the post fight interviews. He's a really exciting guy, very unorthodox when he fights, and he's a multiple talent fighter in a sense that he'll fight Muay Thai, he'll fight boxing, um, and so and he's undefeated really in both of those professional um, fighting arts. So uh, he's three and zero right now, and uh, he's fighting this evening yeah. as well. So Jordan Harris is a local guy here. Um, as you mentioned earlier, Danny Favela, right? Another local talent. He's a he's a hard punching, right? A big heart. Uh, he he lives it all on the ring. He goes for broke. He swings for the fences, you know. And those are the kind of fights that we're excited right. about watching. Danny Favela never uh, disappoints when it comes to getting in the ring and and, and taking care of business. Uh, another local right. talent, Jose Mejia, also um, fighting out of uh, Palmdale. So, like I said, the card stacked with really good solid talent for this evening you know and then so we definitely want any, anybody that has an opportunity to come out and enjoy some great boxing it's it's, it's professional boxing it's it's family oriented uh you know it's a great venue if you've ever been to the pioneer event center uh you know tickets start uh, they're 30 dollars for general admission and 75 for ringside but honestly i tell people you know buy the 30 dollar ones because i'll tell you what when you go to a, uh, an event at the pioneer event center in lancaster the venue is designed so great that it doesn't really matter what ticket you buy or where you sit. You always get a really good view of the event. So um, tickets, $30, not bad for not having to drive to LA or somewhere far for some great boxing talent. In addition to that, you're supporting the local talent, right? You're, you're supporting the local skill set here in the Antelo Valley. So definitely a great night out. Um, Saturday night, some great boxing, uh, you know, and then, you know, it's, it's a family oriented environment. So it's really good for everyone, you know, you take care, buddy. I'll see you right. later. Mm -hmm. Bye-bye. Estrada Roman Promotions presenta Boxeo Profesional Fisto Fury 10 Sábado 18 de noviembre en el Pioneer Event Center en Lancaster Venga y conozca a los campeones del mañana Paula Estrada de Pandel, José Hernández de Lancaster pelearán por su primer título de la GBO Más otras sensaciones locales Danny Favela, Avery Gibson, Juan Funes, Jordan Harris y muchos más Para más información, llamar al 661-209-2047, 661-209-2047. Traído a ustedes por TKT, Vision Engineering, Sam Seal Screening y AB Boxing Club. Boletos disponibles en AB Boxing Club por tíos de Little Rock, Pandel Wireless, D&D Wireless y en UABPet.com. Las puertas se abren a las 5 de la tarde. Boxeo Profesional.